Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, Royal Kids Adventures. Uh, today we're doing a mukbang in the car, which is a Wendy's mukbang. So if you're new to the family, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to be part of the RK squad. And here we are, it's me and Auntie Shayna. Hey! So today guys, we are kind of, we ran away from everyone else in the yep. house. Yep. <clears throat> like we told you, there's 12 of us that live in the house. Five kids, seven adults. And of the five kids, uh, of the five kids, three of them are mine, which is three boys under the age of five. None of them are mine. Yeah, and Shana don't have none. <laughs> so if there's any single guys out there, <laughs> holler at your girl. What? <laughs> we need to marry her off. She needs some babies. Yeah. So as you get to know us, you'll understand all about our little family. And yes, we could be goofy and funny at times. But you see, guys, what I have to put up with every single day it's not only her it is also my mom and my dad too yeah well you know she needs to be married you know <laughs> what i mean like she needs to have some little shayna's running around okay so as you can tell by the title it is uh wendy's mukbang and also why we quit youtube so we're gonna get into all of that but first we want to get in a few little bites and then we're gonna get into everything that we wanted to talk to you about today now let's be real here people we are still new to vlogging so mm -hmm. i do have a notebook with all the notes that i want to cover so if you see me looking down at my looking down in my lap i'm looking at the notebook okay so <laughs> don't hate also like i said before you have 12 people to know and me and shana had to run out of run out of the house like spy ninjas to get out to do this this video for y'all so don't mind our bonnets yes we didn't get to comb our hair because we put baby nathan down and we had to get out of there real like quick. a teeth okay so oh my god the bonnet then switch to another channel but this is what you're going to get today okay half of the hair is done unless if you want to plait here and a ponytail here but this is what you're going to get today okay good so now that we have a good and clear understanding here <laughs> let's get into the video so we are going to start to eat now okay we love you guys we just thank wanna you, thank you thank you thank you guys for all the love and support that you've shown our channel our instagram page it's just very very much appreciated yes. and yeah let's get into it and then we're gonna talk about all that we wanted to talk about today so we hope you enjoy our channel and again thank you for joining our channel don't forget to click the subscribe right button, button and the notification bell to be notified every time we post a new video all right, so let's get into this food. So we went to Wendy's <clears throat> during what's going on right now. Um, we should have brought food from inside to really cook because we wanted to be safe. But again, we had to run out. So that's why we had to end up buying Wendy's. So for the rest of our family that will be seeing this, we are sorry, but we had to do this. Okay, that's we right. are truly sorry. We're not gonna edit this video, so they'll see you guys will see the raw footage of this video, okay? So right now we're parked outside of the house, really, because um ah uh, no, up the street. Okay, we're up the street. We're up the street. Yeah, yeah, we're up the street. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, we're up the street. We're up the street, yeah. yeah. We're up the street. Okay, okay, okay. Fair enough. But basically, we're ten seconds away from the house, okay? So just in case if they call, mm -hmm. we're. We can be around at the house in the next two seconds. Mm -hmm. So, we got some fries. We got some fries here. I love Wendy's fries. I got some ketchup. <laughs> Don't really love the Wendy's ketchup, but I should have got some sauce. Lemonade. Not a lemonade. <clears throat> so guys, comment down below what other videos you want to see us do. And <clears throat> hopefully we can be entertaining to you guys. We're new to YouTube, so not really new new. We've been on YouTube for a year, which we're also gonna get into that and let you know what our experience and challenges has been so mm -hmm. far since being on YouTube. So we'll let you guys know that as well. But yeah. We're just chilling. Today's Monday. 
Brian, Auntie Shayna's car. If remember, you guys, I told, <coughs> remember I told you I put my car on the road, so I'm, I was very excited. Now I'm on the road. I need to do, if there's any errands I need to run, I don't have to wait until to get Auntie Michelle's car. Mm -hmm. Now Auntie Shayna has her own car. Which was also so. long overdue. <laughs> She's a kind of long overdue type person. She takes forever to be doing stuff. Not always. <laughs> Why you hurt me like that? Hence why she's still not married. Mm -hmm. That has nothing to do with it, people. All those people who are still dating out there know that they have to take their time to find the right person because you always have people out there that are frauds and that will try to mess you up. Friends. So again, I'm not close to the opportunity, but i rather take my time. Because I never had good experiences. Well, some good, some bad. Fair enough, Auntie Shayna. Yep. Mm -hmm. We're not like some people that get it right the first time. Uh-huh. I didn't get it right the first time. Or, sorry, the second time. The second time. <laughs> We're not like some people that get it right the second time. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So as you can tell by the title, um, we're going to talk about our experience since we've been on YouTube. And so we started YouTube a year ago in January. And we basically started YouTube because the boys were always on YouTube. And, Watching. and it's not a cliche story because you hear a lot of people saying why they started YouTube, this, that, and the other. But the boys were on YouTube and they were always watching some uh, name brand channels that you guys are used to famous two kids ryan and all of these things and they would always say mommy can we be on computer too so i said okay sure no problem so then we decided to research what this youtube thing was about because i never knew what youtube was until literally a year ago i used to go on it now and then to search like if i put something in google search <coughs> sorry excuse me and you see like images come up videos and if it was something that I needed to learn how to do, then I would click on the video and it would route you to YouTube. But again, I wasn't really paying attention as to what YouTube was. So when they said, um, Mom, can we be on YouTube? Because they were always on kids YouTube. And I knew, I, well, at least I knew enough to download the kids YouTube app so that they could watch. But again, that's as far as my knowledge went with YouTube. And... So what we did was I started to research and I said, okay, let's go on YouTube. Let's make a video. But we thought that doing YouTube was a little bit easy. So I didn't know that it was so much time and work and effort. I yeah. thought it was just like you shoot a video, put it out there and bang that out. <laughs> the video's done. But no, it what that wasn't the case. So when we started, uh, we, we started YouTube January. And then we didn't post our first video, which was our, was our Valentine's video. We'll link that down below, our very first video that we did, which was Valentine's Day video. And um, basically, we just filmed. Now we know what type of video it was that we did, which was a vlog-style type video, because mm -hmm. we just basically vlogged us eating KFC. And then we had ordered some treats, and we had that for the kids and things like that. And just basically what we did that evening. So now we understand that that was a vlog. And then as you go through all the rest of the videos on our channel, you'll see that some of them are vlogs and then some of them are just kids content where it's the kids mostly doing things and they're running the channel because because we wanted it to be about them, we basically just drew some ideas from them in terms of what they wanted to do. So that's what we were doing with the YouTube channel. So that was all of last year. But through that process, we had so many issues. I could, I don't understand why we had so much issues, but we had issues with editing. We had issues with our camera. We had issues mm -hmm. with our um, lighting, and we didn't understand what lighting was. We're just like, what is all of this? So we started to watch tutorials on, on how to start YouTube and all these things. And then that's when we basically understood all of this stuff. 
at first we had an editing program that was connected to our computer and then that shut down and then we had to go out and buy a editing program and then that wasn't really working out so it's just been a challenge so now I think we finally found something that works for us which is just basically filming on an iPhone and just editing it editing it there and then uploading and then posting it to YouTube and then we do our thumbnail separate which we had to learn what that was about as well I will say editing that used to take me forever to do mm -hmm. all the time and I used to get so frustrated with it sometimes my sister would be like Shayna what are you doing you gotta edit the video you gotta edit the video and I'm just like you edit the video like stop asking me to edit the video and you edit it I still don't know how to edit video <laughs> I still, I only plan the videos and do the description and all that stuff in the thumbnail. That's as far as it goes. Editing? Mm -mm. I do the editing and I do the recording. <clears throat> but now yes. she's getting, now Rochelle's getting used to the editing, I mean, the filming. The, the filming, so I don't have to do it all the time, so, which is see, a good thing. If you see some of our videos that we posted, I realized that I was using... Every so often, I'll turn the camera the wrong way, <laughs> and then you'll get that long video, that long shot, Yeah. and then it's not taking up the whole screen. I'm like, good God, what did I do now? So I think finally I got it down pat that you have to keep the camera Sideways. Hor horizontal yep. in order to um, get the shot that you're looking for. So again, we are still learning. It is so funny to me, but you know what? Through it all, we appreciate the learning curve that we're going yeah. through. And we did quit YouTube for a little bit because, again, we were having so much issues and all the time. And throughout that process, we basically quit it the end of last year and up until now we started posting again. Mm -hmm. um, just because we were still having so much issues with editing and anything. It didn't have anything to do with the new, uh, the new rules changes. and the new changes that were coming out because we love doing videos. The boys love doing videos. The girls love doing videos. So... We come to really appreciate the time that, that we have with them filming and things like that. So <clears throat> videos will be something that we will always do. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, again, we're just trying to downpack the little nicks and crannies of the glitches that we keep experiencing. But hopefully this works. The, the iPhone <laughs> works. So, so far for the last two videos we used it. So mm -hmm. I think it's good. Hopefully this one comes out good too. Uh, so we'll take it from there. So that was our experience being on YouTube now. So again, we will always continue to do videos because the kids love it. Every time we're like just taking regular pictures for Instagram, they start talking about, hi guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm like, no guys, it's not a video. So we could tell that they really love doing it. So they enjoy it, yeah. we will continue to do it. So no, we will be on YouTube forever, however long. You know we decide to keep doing it so that is that so and again we love YouTube so we talked about so now I'm gonna refer to my book <laughs> make sure I cover all the, t t all the topics that we want to talk about and we appreciate <clears throat> all the subscribers that we have so far mm -hmm. we appreciate you we thank you so much for staying on our channel and and viewing our videos we really 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 do appreciate it yeah, because you have some, some people, as soon as you post a video, they just jump on, watch your video, mm -hmm. and they comment, and they like it. And, you know, it makes you feel good that what you're doing. It makes you feel good that, like, what you're doing, mm -hmm. uh, you know, people actually like it. So, we hope that we can entertain you, keep you entertained. We hope that you like our channel. And, yeah, if you have any questions or comments... Please comment down below. Let us know how you're feeling. If you experience any challenges with editing and things like that. Like how yep. we have. We we would love to hear it. And again. Um, so those are the challenges. Now everybody in the house. All the adults work. So just we are trying to get um, at least two to three videos out a week. But with everybody's work schedule. It's a little hard. And now with everything that's going on. Yeah. You know everybody's at home now so we're finding that we can record more because everybody is at home 
so which is a positive note uh, and we and we're spending more time with the, with everybody so which is what we love as well um, but once this whole thing is over this COVID-19 is over then everybody will be back to their regular work schedule so we're just trying to get a flow in terms of recording how we're gonna edit and all of that stuff just to make sure that we get the content out there for you guys so that's what we're working on scheduling and um, yeah that should be good and again guys we hope you're staying safe yeah staying positive because we are all experiencing what's happening in the world right now and we just want to encourage you and let you know that be you know it's God knows what he's doing and just look to him and you'll find comfort and peace in him and that's what we're doing together as a family we have continued to pray more we're reading our reading the word more and just getting more into God and just letting him really lead our life leader direct our life and where he wants it to go and we hope that in doing YouTube we could be a positive influence on the world in what we do because again we want to be real real with you guys we want to be realistic with you guys like we face challenges everybody face challenges yeah. but again when you see a lot of people on YouTube and Instagram we think even me we you know we think that their life is perfect um, but in actuality people do have struggles everyday struggles and things like that so we just want to bring to you as much openness as much as we can and there are some stuff that we will keep private uh, which is you know private to us that we keep sacred um, but again for the most part we will be an open book and let you guys know what is what what's going on if you guys have any questions again let us know comment down below and we'll let you know <clears throat> you want your frosty I still, have, I still haven't eaten my burger yet, but we're about to get into it. And we just we just love you guys. We just love the YouTube community. <laughs> outside yes. of being, you know, with the kids and doing a lot of kids stuff and outside of work, getting to know people around the globe, I think, has it's been so cool. the highlight of being on YouTube and Instagram. Because you meet so much people, yeah. and then they share their culture with you. And I think that's what I love the most. Yeah. And yeah like i said we will never ever stop doing it because it is just so fun just being in this community this social media life it's different it's fun and you get to learn and you get to grow and as you're learning you're growing with other people who are facing the same challenges as you so that's what we definitely like uh the last point that we wanted to cover is where what direction our channel is going so like i said we have a different mix of different variety of videos on our channel but we will continue to do kids content because the kids again the kids love doing the arts and the craft and the cooking and all that stuff mm -hmm. but we're gonna try to um, include the adults more like more vlogging and things like that so hopefully you guys like to see that or you like to see mukbangs challenges pranks you could also comment down below and give us some more ideas um, but yeah though that's the direction of our channel um, we're just gonna be just doing everything pretty much everything so we're gonna have a mixture of kids content as well as Blogging. content content that's a um, widespread so that everybody could enjoy it and not only kids so that's what we're gonna be doing um, yeah I, I don't really have anything else to say because our battery's kind of low <laughs> so we just want to <laughs> Let you know, see, challenges of being on YouTube. And listen, <laughs> what's going on in the world, COVID-19, social distancing is the best. Yeah. Because, again, you don't want, like, let's say if you have it and you don't know you have it, and then you go amongst family and friends and then they catch it, and then you're, <clears throat> and, and then they get sick. So, again, government said social distancing is the best as of right now please 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 social distancing is the best right now for everyone so just and follow for the advice of your safety. of your government just follow the advice of your government and then once everything is done you know that and everything is clear everybody's doing fine then you know that we can get back and resume going to social events and all that stuff mm -hmm. and having fun again you just have to have fun in your house as of right now so that's so, yeah. what we're practicing that's what we're teaching the kids um so we're trying to find a lot of activities to do at home yeah 
which is fun. Ooh. And people, it is hard. It is so hard. These kids stay at home. Whew. It is hard. I give teachers everything. I give them everything because they a do a dollars, lot. dollars because they do a lot. Mm. They do a lot. And when I mean a lot, they do a lot from keeping them safe, um, teaching them their education, um, to just making sure that they're having a wonderful time at school, enjoying school, and learning, and learning, um, learning, learning with um, other other peers coming from different countries and stuff. They're good. They're they're Hats excellent. Hats off to all the teachers. Hats off to them. These little guys at home. Mm -hmm. As soon as you say pick up a book, everybody start running. They start everybody. to scatter all over the place. They scatter. They run, go jump on their tablet, their phone, their this, the computer. They try to do everything else but homework. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. They're not having it. Mm -mm. So I had to ask them. I said, guys, when you guys are at school and the teacher says, time to pick up your book, do you guys do this? They're like, no, we listen. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> like no we listen I'm like okay so why aren't you and listening to thing, us that's the thing that gets me all the time how are you listening to the teacher well yes you obviously have to listen to the yeah, teacher yeah obviously listen to your teacher but when you come home you have to do the obviously same thing too obviously you have to too. listen to your parents too <laughs> you have to do Kids, the same thing too listen to your parents listen we only want parents. what's best for you listen to your parents listen, okay listen <laughs> You, it's, this time is not time to have free play. You get free play, but there's still time for work. Yeah, work and play. Work and play. There's time for everything mm -hmm. under the sun. You have time to play. You have time to laugh. You have time to cry. You have time to sleep. You have time to be awake. There's time for everything. So you still yeah. have to do work, even though there's no school. Mm -hmm. And these guys are not having it. <laughs> yeah, no, they want to play 24-7. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, that's not how it works. You have to do some work too. So we had to lock off the um the computer, lock off their phones, we their tablets, off. everything. We have to take their phone and, and keep do it. Do you remember back in the day we never had well, we're phone, up. tablet, nothing? We're 80s babies, okay? Mm -mm. We never we had Sega Genesis. We had outside. We had outside. And we had a little TV with the antenna and you used to turn and go coop 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 coop. <laughs> That's the TV we had. We never had phone. Only the adults had that old time gray Motorola phone, the flip mm -hmm, phone, mm -hmm. the big thick one. Mm -hmm. <coughs> that's what our uncle had. And that's the only um, thing of a cell phone we knew that was out there. Yep. That was it. And other than that, we were outside playing mm -hmm. all the time. Especially when summer holiday, we played outside from morning till night. Yep. Hide and go see, jump rope, mm -hmm. everything. Double Dutch. It's like, we played this everything. One, this one is a good one, but it's also not right. Nikki Nikki Nine Door. Oh, Nikki Nikki Nine Door. Yeah. <laughs> that, <laughs> that one was good, too. That one was good, but not good for the people who had to answer the door. <laughs> so we played all these stuff, and we watched TV. Like, we're coming at 8 o'clock. All the good shows started, like, 7 mm -hmm. o'clock. You had Saturday morning cartoons. You put on the TV for these guys to watch Saturday morning cartoons. They're like, what's that? We, we don't want to watch it. Uh, Saturday morning cartoon with a bowl of cereal. That's what we yep. have. And then the bowl turned into the whole box. That's what we, that's what we were doing. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> and my mom had three of us. Three mm -hmm. long belly pitney. Mm -hmm. Three. Sorry, that's a Jamaican term. Three long belly kids who had to eat. So, three, three kids that love to eat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so basically, that's what our Saturday morning was until after 12 o'clock when Saturday morning cartoon was done, that we were gone outside to play. Yep. These kids, they pick, the first thing they want is a phone and a tablet. Sorry, we're ranting. But, you know, <laughs> we can't do it anywhere else. We might as well do it to y'all. <laughs> but you see, they understand, though. That's the thing. Mm -hmm. They get it. Mm-hmm. Is they're going through the same thing too? These new age kids. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't forget. <clears throat> Remember when Sammy was like, Mommy, I want an iPhone 11 Pro Max. What you know about that? <laughs> mm -hmm. What you know 
know about that. Mm -hmm. That's the phone I want. <laughs> and I know about it. We couldn't even utter those foolishness out of our mouth to our parents. Mm -mm. A what? Phone? You pay bill? I know, right? Mm -mm. Back, in the, back in the days, our parents were different. Oh, yeah. They were more rough. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Oh. Oh. That's how it goes. Uh, what's going on, well, thank you for listening to us. <laughs> Ranting and raving. <laughs> <coughs> but in the next video, guys, we'll be definitely introducing everyone. I know mm -hmm. we've been saying it for a couple of videos now for the last two or three videos that we had, that we have posted. Yep. But we'll definitely introduce everyone so that you can see the whole entire family. So the ages in our house ranges from our 80 old 80 80 year old grandmother to my one year old son so that's what it is mm -hmm. so we will have that video for you <coughs> coming our very next one. coming very soon yeah because now we have more time to film so mm -hmm. you'll be able to see that one we don't want to make this video too long so i'm going to finish up my burger i have a frosty here we're going to get going back inside because nathan's nap will be done soon mm -hmm. And we still have to prepare dinner and continue on with their learning and things like that. Yeah. So guys, thanks for watching. Always, like we always say, be safe, be positive. We're all in this together. Uh, again, if you're new to the channel and you made it to the end of the video, we thank you for watching. Leave yep. a comment down below and let us know what you think about our car mukbang. If you like, if you want to see more of it or not, we thank you. We appreciate you all and yeah so that's it so don't again don't forget to comment like and subscribe to our video be a part of the rk squad yeah be a part of the rk squad you can also link down below you'll see our social media which is our instagram channel we're on that now that we're getting back into the swing of stuff we're on that more so we're on that uh every day posting what we yeah. eat posting the kids what they're doing every day and just doing silly stuff it's not like a edited photo type instagram no, it's just like no. raw footage <laughs> we don't know what editing she caught instagram me in my night clothes one time it's guys, raw footage you guys are getting on footage. there it's not like photoshop <coughs> pictures or anything like that it is just raw us every day in the house we have to hide from her especially when we see her have her phone in yeah, her hand I'm, now i'm we the instagram have, queen yeah we have to run from her if you are not properly dressed you're going up on Instagram going up however on Instagram. you look. <laughs> so you have to be prepared at all times. Yeah. All right. So, you guys, follow us on Instagram. And, yeah, we love you guys. Peace.